So today, I'm titling this edition, Chasing Fame. Fame may come not only because you've won a reality show or because you are a superstar doing one thing, but it's always there because people follow you. And by virtue of what you do, they begin to ascribe to the values that you hold. So what values do my famous people hold? That's what I'll be discussing with three young people who have become famous by virtue of the platforms that they exposed themselves to. You know, I, I would say while I was in the house, I was um, representing a lot of things, you know, a lot of people. I was representing my country, my family. When I say my family, not only my parents, you know, my siblings, my country, you know, everybody that believed in me, you know. So um, it's just all about decency, you know what I'm saying, you know. I've, I've had people, you know, who challenge me that, ah, so why didn't you have sex in the house? And I'll be like, who would do that? You know, if you were in my shoes, would, can you have sex in front of your parents? Look for your talent. That's where your wealth is. That's where your fulfillment is, you know. And we, did, we were um, raised not to, we weren't driven by money. We we're driven by service, we we're driven by fulfillment, we we're driven by passion, love, change for, you know, change. Yeah, those were the values that we were brought up with. I loved fashion so much. Uh, one of my sister's friends used to call me Shakok Bewa. But, but <laughs> Shakok God, Bewa, what does that mean to you? Shakok Bewa is someone that, you know, you pose, pose, and then you get a plate of beans. <laughs> <laughs> you need a platform. You know, it's, we, when in, we are in, in an industry where people support tangibility. What they can see and What feel. they can see and feel. You know, you really don't get people who be, really believe in potential. Tell me, when, when uh, you didn't win, what did you feel like? It was hard. It was sad, you know, honestly, because I'm human. It's hard to put in three months of work and expectations and then not come out with what you felt like was going to change your life. Okay, but change then, your life, that's the key. You wanted to change your life too. But, but then I came out of the show and I realized how blessed I was because although I did not win the car and the five million, I want a whole lot more. I want fans all over the world. I want a lot of respect from people in the industry. 